Welcome back all, how are you all going? This is um, part two of getting honey out of my honey. Getting ha harvesting honey today, there we go. Uh, you can see we haven't got that much out so far. It's still got some in there, it's a slow, very slow process. And it's very thick. I'm gonna drop in the honey in there. It looks good. Oh, here they are. Oh, tastes fantastic. Um, as you can see in here, it's getting there. Okay, there you try to focus on the right one. Yeah, it's getting there slowly. I'm literally going to let it drain out till it stops coming. Um, you know, I'm just going to literally let, let that drain out until it stops flowing completely. Because you're supposed to be able to get two litres of honey out of each one. So unless that's not capped all the way or is it just too thick, the honey. Um, it should be capped all the way. Uh, not much you can do about it. It is quite nice though. Just going to let that honey go down the... Heaven on earth, I tell you. Absolutely heaven on earth. Mm. I'm trying to get the taste where it comes from. It's sweet, but not overly sweet at all. Compared to other honeys I've had, this is just oh, perfectly balanced. It's not. It's just really nice honey to have. And it settled and um, gave some to the next door. It's a little bowl, a little bit in the bowl, so they can have it on toast. And in less than, probably less than 10 minutes, I think it was, it was starting to set. It was really thickening up, so that's a good sign. It's got less, um, less water and that in there, so I've been sitting down here just watching this flow and seeing how it goes. But we'll take our time and have a look at it. Oh, they're pulling that apart now. Which is, they're, they're doing pretty well, they're pretty fast, they're pulling that apart. But it's still closed though, to all. It's all closed, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it's all closed, so. They don't need to get access to that anyway till I'm. I'm going to wait till this, all this honey goes before it stop, literally stops flying. Then I'll close it all up. And that's taking quite a few hours. Um, so I'm looking at minimum, say, two to maybe four hours each frame. So I want to do, I have to do a test again when the weather gets a bit warmer. Um, I'll harvest another one. What I want to try to do is keep the honey separate too. So when I've finished harvesting this one, next one I harvest will be the one next to it, and then the one next to that. But I'll do them separate days though. I won't do them at the same time. Wait until it gets warm, and I want to get a like a plastic tube over the end of this. So I have to go to sale and get a um, plastic tube over the end of that, and another container where I can just have the plastic tube go straight into the other container. And I'll be. The bees landed on me. It is quite warm. And that it does taste beautiful. I don't think I worry about filtering it because unless there's something in, in there like a bee or something else has gotten into there like a twig or something like that for or like a leaf or something like that falling into there or another insect. I'm not gonna worry about it. A little bit of wax won't hurt you, it's actually quite good for you. It's all 100% natural. And you can see there, that chamber, it looks like it's empty from here. But unless that, unless that stops flowing through there, right, unless that stops flowing, um, 
I'm not going to worry about it. Like, um, I'll let that go till it stops flowing. It looks like it's still, it's a nice, it's still coming out, but uh, uh, it's going to take a while, long time for it to come out. <laughs> As you can see. Oh, well. I'm in no hurry. Let the bees do the thing. I'll have a cup of tea and relax and um, let the bees just do their thing. Let the honey just do its thing and just let that pour out. If that, probably another hour, maybe two hours. I'd say before it comes finishes coming out. I'm not worried if it takes that long to come out. And it's stripped down the side of the honey. Oh, I thought they had that full. They're not working too much on the other side of the other one. You can even see them down the bottom and cleaning up down there. Shoot off, it will take an easier one. It's fantastic just to sit here and watch the bees do, do the thing and have a cup of tea and just watch the honey flow. Oh, well, thank you for watching. You all have a great day.